All right, let's get an actual uh, video in now. Um, I was just like, like, sorry, you know, you know what? When something, when something pisses you off, it's hard to go back into regular mode and and, and do something like, like even do a video on money or anything. Um, it's just, you know, what I mean, it's just, I, I, I don't, I'm not, I'm not that type of guy. You know what I mean? I'm not, I'm not, I, you know, and I said, you know what? So. Yeah, I'm not that type of guy, man. You know, I don't take shit like that. You know what I mean? You're not, you know, like, and it's like, what level are you trying to compete with me at? You know, and sometimes I feel like reminding girls, like, listen, man, you gotta understand, you might brag about your uncle. Dude, your uncle is not even at my level, man. And I know it's, it's hard to believe because I look very youthful and I'm good looking and everything. So t typically, you know, uh, Girls want to secretly bully a guy like that. The guy that's good looking, that doesn't have notches taken off of him, that's, you know, successful, that's strong, that people respect in the public, that people like in the public. You know, there's some foul girls out there and they love screwing with guys like that, like me, on the low. Like they just want to do it as long as nobody knows that they're doing it. You know what I mean? They don't want any. They don't want the public to know that they're the ones doing it. See what I mean? And they just want to get away with it, so they'll do whatever little thing they can. You know what I mean? I'll tell you. You know, imagine a girl giving you attitude, and imagine me telling her this, dude. I know that there was a guy that broke your heart, the one guy you 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 were admired and had crushes on, and all that. You wanted to marry and live with him forever and all that stuff. And dude, that guy was mediocre. So why do you think that you can come and play games with me right now? You know what I mean? And then you know what level they love to take it at? Well, this guy's a bank robber. He's a criminal. He deserves to be treated worse. You know what I mean? He deserves to be treated worse than anybody else. Don't be fooled by his looks and his politeness. He is, after all a bank robber he did rob a bank <laughs> i mean it's like dude it's crazy man like, like like dude if you won't do that in front of people why do you want to do that like in secret you know what i mean and if a guy is gonna reveal you dude i listen i'm not a snitch or anything and, and i try not to whistle blow but I, I i i will reveal i'm not i've never been shy of the public you know what i mean i've never been shy to speak in the public or to reveal anything in the public at the same time, I'm not a scumbag and I'm not a piece of shit. You know what I mean? I'm not, I'm not a hustler and I'm not a shyster. You know what I mean? So, and I got that on my record from, you know what, man, in my life, when I grew up as a kid, my word had so much power to it that, um, that like that, that I was so, uh, what's the word? Uh, systemically strong that, that I was weak in a uh, primitively, like primitively I was weak. You know what I mean? Um, as in the monkey game, or not, I should call the monkey, the jungle game, I was weak. My jungle game was super weak, but my systemic game was off the hook, man. I had been sent to the principal's office one time for something, and I talked my way, and I talked to the principal, and it was like, all right, you're not gonna get a suspension or anything. I, I, I talked my way out of things all the time, and, and teachers respected me, like, 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 it was crazy, man. Systemically, I was always on top. A phone company tries to screw me over. A company is not paying me for for for, for the wages that that they owe me. I'm writing letters, emailing, and I get and I always got everything done, man. I always got everything done, you know. Um, but it's it's ridiculous. Like these, like now. So so the way they view me is that they think I'm primitively strong now and I'm systemically weak. And the truth is, I'm strong in both ways. You know what I mean? And and and, and I bet you three days later. Yeah, yeah oh, it's okay. They'll forget in a few days. We'll, we'll, we'll start up again. You know what I mean? It's ridiculous, man. It's ridiculous. Like, that's why I say in public, like, honestly, you, you know, there are some people, like Paris Hilton, for example. I'm telling you, Paris Hilton or Nelly Furtado. I guarantee you, if somebody slapped them in public, the whole, everybody would be cheering. Everybody would start cheering. Woo! Yeah! You know what I mean? I swear to God, I'm not even, you know it too, man. You know that somebody slapped all Paris Hilton or Nelly Furtado, everybody would start cheering. 
You know what I mean? Everybody would just start, yeah, everybody would be cheering in the crowd, man. Families, kids, old people, regular people, everybody would be cheering, man. You know, for someone like those people that get slapped the fuck out, man, you know what I mean? It's like, it's like people would go crazy, like, holy shit, hallelujah. You know what I mean? Like, oh my God. But the, the attitude on these bitches, man, the attitude on these bitches, it's crazy, man. And you know, the worst thing is, and this is my issue, is that whenever females talk to me, and whether they're snakes or whatever they are, you know, it's like, it's like, oh yeah, how are you? Oh, you're so nice. You know what I mean? It's like what, it's like they act, they put on this act, and then behind my back, it's oh, fuck him, fuck him. And it's like, dude, listen, that's what I realized I was better than, than most people out there. That's when I realized, when, when I realized that I didn't take pedophilia or child murder as a joke, when I was in a piece of shit, when I didn't go behind people's backs, when I wasn't two-faced, when I realized that, I realized that some people are, I was like, dude, I am so much better than these people, man. I am so much better than these people. And it's not just what I think, that's what the public thinks, man. The public thinks that about me, man. I have integrity, man. I grew up with integrity, man. Since, since, since the day I went to school, man, I grew up with integrity. Everybody knew that, man. Everybody knew that, everybody knew that about me, you know? It's crazy, man. It's crazy. But, but I think, you know, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. If they think your primitive game is weak, they're going to come at you primitively. If they think your systemic game is weak, they're going to come at you systemically. Both my games are strong. You know what I mean? But it, the frustration is that it has to be tested. You know, they're going to test the waters. And when they get blown the fuck up or they get bit the fuck up, they're going to go, all right, let's not do this again. <laughs> you know what I mean? But it's ridiculous. Why does that have to happen for you to understand that you shouldn't be do like like they think it's okay to make pedophilic jokes? I've seen women who, who girls and women who make pedophilic jokes, and I'm like thinking in my head like, dude, what the f what what what's wrong with you, man? Like seriously, what's wrong with you? I remember when I was a kid, there was a guy who was like in his twenties, and he's checking out a twelve year old girl, right? And I go to, and I, I'm laughing. I'm like, dude, do you realize she's only 12 years old? You know what he tells me? He says the prophet Muhammad married his, his wife. He had a wife named Aisha. She was 12 years old when he married her. So it's okay to do that. So he was saying that religiously, Islam allows for pedophilia, religiously. That it's legal in Islam to commit pedophilia. You know, then you have your guys who God knows what they're doing. You know what I mean? Jerking off the, you know, it's crazy, man. And you think like this guy used to be my neighbor, man. That's so screwed up, man. Holy shit. This guy put on an act like he was the coolest guy in the world and he was so nice and everything. And he's just a total piece of shit. Like, holy shit. And, and you know, I look back on these people, I look at them and I think about it. I'm like, I know what they're thinking, right? They're thinking right now, if only he knew what a loser I was. If only he knew what a loser I was out there. You know, if only he knew who I was out there. Dude, like, I hate that shit. You know you're one person out there. Why are you coming in this inside an office or something and acting like you're fucking king or queen shit, man? We know who you are, for God's sakes, man. I can show you who you are. Literally, if everyone's sitting here, I can show everybody who that person is. It's, it's, it's insane, man. It's insane. It's so crazy, man. I, I, I can't accept attitude from a pedophile, man. I'll just slap the shit out of him. You know what I mean? I can't accept, or, or her, or her. I don't like this whole pedophile shit. You know what I mean? I don't know.